Uh, welcome again to our Bible Talk video blog. I'm Mike Mazzalongo and today we're talking about uh, recipes for success. I've already given you two recipes for success in other blog posts. The first one was the family stew, the recipe for family success. The second one was the personal pan pizzazz, that was the recipe for career success. And our last recipe in the series is for spiritual success. Regardless of your uh, 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 family or your career situation, in order to have success on a spiritual level, you have to drink the living water. Spiritual success requires that we drink the living water. Um, who knew, uh, who knew that 25 years ago that we would pay more for a bottle of tap water than a can of Coke? But it's a fact. Companies offer every kind of water with all kinds of uh, marketing spins. Uh, you can get pure water, enriched water, flavored water, spring water, water from glaciers, water from Fiji, water from mountaintops, streams, and secret, uh, secret places. And now the promises of these various waters is that they either make you healthy or make you cool, you know, make you modern, uh, or all three. Uh, and so for this privilege of being healthy or cool or whatever, we pay maybe two to five dollars for a bottle of water and are quickly filling up the landfills with empty plastic bottles that will take a thousand years to decompose. Well, that's the decomposition uh, issue is, a, is another thing we'll talk about another day. Now, the one thing that these uh, types of water uh, you know, marketing things that they never promise is life itself. They, they promise to improve your life or improve your look, but they don't promise to give you any type of new life. The water that I'm talking about in this blog actually gives you another kind of life in addition to the one that you already have, and the life that living water gives you is eternal life. You see, earthly water sustains earthly life. The living water that I'm talking about creates and sustains an eternal spiritual life. Jesus talked about this living water to a woman that he met one hot day in Samaria, and he asked her for a drink of regular water. And then he said to her the following thing. He said, if you only knew the gift that God has for you and who I am, you would ask me and I would give you living water. That's in John chapter 4, verse 10. And so this water I'm talking about to you today is the water that Jesus talked to this woman about so long ago. Now, I don't have a, a recipe for it. I just drink it and recommend that you drink it also. I can tell you, however, three things about this water that you may not know. First of all, I can tell you what it is. The living water is God's word, the word of God contained in the Bible. That's the living water. Reading it, sharing it, hearing it, thinking about it, this is how you, this is how you drink in the living water. Secondly, I can tell you what it does. The living water changes you into a God-like person. The more you drink, the more you respond to it, the more you become like Jesus Christ. In other words, you become alive like He is alive the living water changes the quality of your life experience, something that earthly water uh, doesn't promise and certainly cannot do. And I can tell you why we need it. Without earthly water, we can only stay alive a month or so. But without the living water, we cannot live longer than the body itself will live. So Jesus' invitation to the Samaritan woman is open to us as well today. Those who drink the living water that He offers will experience a regenerated life in this world and an eternal life in the next world. The living water is the most precious gift a family can share because it guarantees that they will be together forever. And so this completes our three-part series on the three recipes for success. Recipe number one, the family stew for uh, successful families. Uh, number two, the career uh, pizzazz uh, recipe, three steps for a successful career. And then today's blog, the living water, the water that gives you eternal life. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for uh, uh, looking in. Uh, if you'd like to contact me, uh, comments, questions, whatever, you can uh, write me at 
mike at bibletalk.tv and I'll be happy to answer whatever, uh, whatever emails that you send. Uh, in the meantime, God bless you and we'll see you next time with the Bible Talk video blog.